Hello, hello, hello! How's everyone doing? It's, uh, it's been a hot second, huh? Welcome, welcome, welcome to Frank and Mummy and Fragment and Goo! Hope everyone's doing okay. Hope you, uh, you all had lovely holidays, whatever you celebrate. Got some some time off work, if nothing else. <laughs> Go, please. Did I not suffer enough last time? Um. Also, wow, this, this OST goes it goes a little more than I thought it did, huh? But yeah, I've um I've really missed streaming. I've missed chatting with uh with everyone. Um my holidays have been good. They've just been busy. Like work was obviously we had people out of work for the the week leading up to Christmas and then, you know, 
Christmas, I actually had plans proper, so... But, um... I'm, I'm very, very glad to be able to stream again today. Um, I'm not sure... I'm not sure how Sunday looks, but... We'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. The bugs can wait. <laughs> Frank, no! Um, but, but yeah. Hope everyone else had a, had good breaks, good foods, enough sleep. I um <laughs> I I relearned because I totally forgot how to do it because I haven't done too much with um VTube Studio uh accessories in a while. But I like just a couple of minutes before stream remembered how to uh how to reload um a uh a, a group of of accessories all at once, so yeah, professional streamer. Professional cat-eared streamer. <laughs> but, um, I'm not sure if we have much else in the way of housekeeping to do. Um, I will say that, um, we, we do, uh, we, we do have a very special cat to to show at the end of stream, but... Thank you. <sighs> Thank you, Frank, and congratulations to Fragment for becoming perfectly average. Um... But yeah, if, if anybody else happened to to want to uh, talk about talk about their cats, have me show them off on um on uh on on stream toward the end get them internet famous <laughs> because uh <laughs> you know um that's 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 why you go to uh twitch.tv slash cricket <laughs> to uh to get internet famous um but yeah if you if you happen to want to show off your cat um i uh, made a tweet asking for them. You can put them there. I will check there again before the end of stream. Or if you have me on Discord, um, send there. Always happy to uh, to show off, show off more Kit Kats. Um, but speaking of showing off Kit Kats, let's um, get properly started. Um, uh, are you gonna behave this time? I think so. Yeah! Oh, there's a chapter select just built into the save system. Cool. We'll take that. But, last we left off, um... Well... Uh, well, last stream was our, uh, was our first stray stream. So, we are this little kitty, we fell into this, like, underground city, um, that is full of robots. We have a, we have a little friend in our backpack, we're trying to get back up, and, and, and uh, the way that we're trying to get back up to the surface is, uh, is through helping these uh, these robots that have uh, have their own little civilization down here. Look, I know. Little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of their antenna. Come meet me there. I locked the window. The code open is quite simple. It is. 
careful, it is case sensitive. See you at the bar. Momo. That must be the code for the window near the entrance. Let's go. Earth is the third planet of the sun and fifth largest in the solar system by mass and diameter. To date, it's the only celestial object known to foster life. Oh, goo. Thank you for the 18 month resub. That's. It's so many. A year and a half. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, according to radiometric dating. Okay. Again, only for the 20 months. Thank you. How dare you? I can't believe you would. You would hype train me. In my own stream. I mean, I guess where else are you going to hype train someone? But still. Um, moon. Gravitational interaction. <laughs> Gravitational interaction with the moon creates ties, stabilizes the Earth's axis for rotation, and gradually reduces its rotation speed. And thank you for the the gift sub to Hemlock, who um if if anybody is not aware, um problem. Thank you. Yeah. At least let me finish that sentence. Um Hemlock is the uh the rigor of this model. Um I'll I'll do a I'll do a quick quick Or Frank Good. But yes, go go check out the, the people that um that made this model possible. Here's the lock for the window. The code was mm, it was an H, I think. Error wrong key. Whoops, my bad. Okay, let's try that again. Mm. And then it was an O, or was it a zero? Or was that MMH? Let's see. Success! It worked. Momo is at the bar waiting for us. <laughs> Hi there, Flex. Uh, you know, just a perfectly average. Uh, I'm sure. I'm sure there's a pun to be made here. Catling. Uh, and thank you for the oh hey good um thank you for the gift sub to flex as well well she <laughs> the brim with Frank <laughs> I mean uh, I mean it sure is there are a lot of robots around here So, the bar is... I'm sure we can just, we can just kind of wander until we find the bar. And Cthulhu, hi there. Nice footwork. Good job, bud. We're fortunate to have these items tablets to friend against the Zerks. The sentence has its threats and preparation as tools. The music sheet and I'm playing instruments are. No problem, Lido. Hidden <laughs> gems in this trash. Tiny from heaven. Or from somewhere, anyway. Map. 
I need to not just fucking echolalia this game. <laughs> it can and will be used against me. Well, the word stuff that happens to you, mate. I don't dare leave our village. It's too dangerous. Besides, the guard needs to see only one who can open this door. If they're hitting the streets and the next day deserts, it comes them completely. It's crazy, right? They can eat everything. <laughs> King Car was echoing this game. That's that's very good. I hope they're doing well. Please tell them I said hi. And also, meow. Where can I jump to from here? Careful knocking those paint cans around. You might fucking home alone, somebody. Announcement. Looking for someone capable of monitoring the southern entrance to the safe zone. The remuneration is two pints of fuel oil per day. Please contact the Guardian. Uh, none of those are a bar. That's when I am looking for any sheet music for my guitar dance. I need to find them bringing them back to me and looking at the elevator and more rusk. The elevator is where we're going, getting to eventually, but... Quacked. It's very good. <laughs> I'm glad they're doing okay. Rip humans less than three. Humans were the first residents around here. Seems they're all dead now. What do you think it feels like being dead? I know it's silly coming from me, but are they actually at peace? Will I be at peace when I die? I don't know what death feels like for an AI. I'm sorry. I didn't want to break the mood. Let's move on. Hell yeah! Whoa. It came out alarmingly fast. But also, uh... <laughs> Thank you for the hype train, everyone. It's very much too sweet of you. This is where we came in, right? Yeah, because I think the Guardian ran down that way. Closed it off. Grandma Clothing. Are you Grandma Clothing? I do love knitting. So far, I've knitted 478 miles of scarves. It's something to do. If you bring me some electric cable, I can make you a poncho. You inspire me. It's not easy to find the right materials around here. Love you, Grandma. The purring. Let me read these clothes. Waterman is looking for stuff like that. Your name is Guap? <laughs> Elliot programming. Knock on the door and wait for us to open. Hi. Oh, 
hope you don't mind that I'm stealing your sheet music. Your programs can be slave, but since 254487555 days, we have a soul. Hope one day the outsiders will find me except for this hell, Momo. What you wanted it's just scars for the robot zone, but only I showed up. No! Here, for Elliot, he's just over there. Little robo snores. Peek. Peek. Hey, bud. Yes, can I help you? Achievement unlocked a little chatty for meowing so many times. This tree is a scientific marvel. It's remarkable that human ingenuity found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Organic life requires trees to purify the city's air. Robots don't need it, but they take care of them anyway. It's what the humans would have wanted. You got a, uh, you got a message, like, uh, I didn't, I didn't see an auto mod or anything. You good? What are you putting into my chat about robots? A bar. It was literally just behind me when I ran by here. Hey, Metal Furball. Come here. I managed to get a signal. Is Momo supposed to be reminiscent of, like, that... that one specific text-to-speech voice? The warden that kind of sounds like this. And it inflects downward at the end of every sentence. Really? I guess bar, home of famous drink. You do around here. What can I do for you? <laughs> so I know you're the bartender, but do you want a drink? But how's it going? Hey, but how's it going? Somebody remember 1283 for me. You can do it by inhaling while you speak. Let me see if I can get this thing working.
Also, what, what is, what is this pinned comment? Oh, that's, that's, uh, that's 1283. Thank you. <laughs> I just, I got the notification that it, that a comment was pinned and kind of panicked for a second. I've almost got it. Can anyone hear me? Hello. Hello. Yes, we can hear you. We are from the slums. We are looking for a way out, and... Wait, is that you, Svaltazar? Momo? I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice, Svaltazar. Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes, we are safe. Is that should be. We found a way up. Hello, do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers to reach us. Very dangerous. Rooks everywhere. Sewers? How? Hello? Start it! We've lost the signal. I can't believe it. Baltazar is alive. And he and the other outsiders managed to go up through the sewers. The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums. But if Baltazar made it, there must be a way. With that. You'll never get past the sewers. It's infested with Zerks. I mean, can quite me out of you, especially you, little one. Men have tried their luck in the past. It doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you. Your business is none of my business. used to be a great scientist, known for working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago he went off the test of the device and never came back. Seamus has never been the same since. Don't listen to Seamus, he's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There might be a clue in James' apartment. Come on, follow me. <laughs> Channeling my inner <laughs> I uh, I did recently go to a um, to a to a science museum where there was a uh, there was a robot. Who was named Ada. Very cute. <laughs> Hi there, Rose. What's funny is I actually just uninstalled um I just uninstalled Warframe earlier to free up some space on my storage drive so I could install more games that I got for Christmas. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> How are you doing, Rose? Hmm. How... Can I even sing while inhaling like that? <laughs> I don't know if that's uh that's something I can do. A lot of cleaning. Went to the landfill. Oh always a good time. 
question mark? Played Ghost of Tsushima. Hope you had fun. Also, I I love whoever this figure is. Hey bud. Oh, this guy is better not drop a paint bucket again or else Cosmo will be ticked off. Did you just moo? I mean, I do see your cowboy hat, but... Spider-Man. But where is the Bartman? important information this one was composed by our own algorithm <laughs> good find For that music, I will practice. Thank you. Sign more. Sir! Sure. balls? Sounds cool. Here, watch that. Oh god, no! Not again! My controls are actually reversed while this is on my head. <laughs> Good job, friend. Ballad of a Lonely Robot, I think I can play this, look. Cats, cats enjoy being in bags. Not specifically just their heads, though. They usually like to see. Ooh, bluesy. No, see, it's okay if AI composes the the song here, because the robots are very cute. <laughs> the little little the little riff. Oh god, it is Boston Dynamics all over again. Cool down. I think I can play this. I like this one. It's a little elevator music y, but like, complimentary. Let's go! <laughs> I know this isn't super engaging stream, stream content, but I'm really enjoying this little music robot. It's 
one kind of goes. <laughs> Hi. Hi there, Nyadia. How are you doing? Oh, hi there, Spooky. Uh, also, this is... This is so long. Um, I'm sorry. It's, it's very good to see you. And uh, if there's anything we can do to help, Certainly available after stream, but well, I guess we're just gonna let you do that. Um, oh, right, but um, expose. So that's um, that turns turns my uh, my 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 face a little spooky. Oh, thank you for the gift, some Daria. Um, it turns it turns my face a little spooky. So if you're if you're if you're not into like some some monstery body body horror ish kind of things, you may wanna look away for for just a couple minutes. Uh, we we'll usually do it for about five ish minutes, but bah. This has this has a very different feeling with the cat ears. <laughs> uh was it perhaps one, two, eight, three? Yeah! More sheet music! Oh, I I mean the, the eyes are just on toggle with, um, I think it's the observe, uh, redeem. I know I have, I have too many that just, that just changed my, my appearance in different ways, but, uh, there we go. Thank you, Frank. Untitled. It contains exactly 44 notes. Thank you. Queepy is what I'm going for. Oh yeah, fucking bop over here. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Thank you for the bits. Uh, thank you for the bit spooky. <laughs> well, we got eight. Unreadable sheet music. Huh, not very readable. I can still try. Sometimes you just gotta eyeballs. Uh, you okay, friend? I don't think you're supposed to... Okay. They get shut out so violently. Well, that's all the music I got, but it's been lovely, Morusk. <laughs> Please do not impale the cat, glitch your no. Let me in. 
other chest. So you can paint buckets on the roof, keep your paint away, painting is too pleasing your stoop. Okay. Artemis sign points this way. Why is it so easy to get lost here? Artemis sign points. I guess this way? Well... Damn it. I realized a little bit too late. Oh, are you the... are you the Bargerman? Marketplace! There's some, some changes against that. Ancient relic, tell them to the town. Our ancestors collect three energy drink cans. Super spirit detergent. This is a more complete bartering system than I expected. It's a soleil! Hi there! Come on, Janice. Open the door. You know your father would have wanted to help us. I'll be right back, Momo. Promise. I just, uh... Have some potentially terrible music to hear. The way you compute tonight. <laughs> right, Flex? Also, it's been five minutes, so we're gonna... We're gonna unscary mode. And accidentally cut out the music for a second and trying to do it. The syncopation is fun. I think that's one that we already saw. Okay, anyway. I'm not gonna go out of my way to look for... for more nonsense, but... Well, that was to be expected. This situation is pretty tough on Seamus. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me. But you... I think I have an idea. Breaking time. Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. It contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as an electro-jock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try to re public communication with the others. <laughs> hey, uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I can do, uh... If I can do a, a an irate Irish accent, but <laughs> your voice scares you a little. <laughs> uh, it's it's fun though. 
Thank you for the quench. What are you doing here? I told you, getting through the sewers is a suicide mission. Leave me be. What's this? Wait, is this my papa's? Oh wow, I never knew. There's a secret room here in our flat. But where? No thanks, I'm not thirsty. Time to knock over all your paintings. Time will tell. Is it two o'clock, one o'clock? Oh, two o one? There are no zeros. Uh. Oh, there are clocks in the middle of them, too. Uh. Two, five, one, one. Mizu, hi there. Cat simulator with, you know, just with some story thrown in there. I, I'm, I'm really enjoying it. It's very cute. I get to do some dumb robot voices. I, uh, I get to dress up like a cat. You know, the huge. I've never seen this room. Can't believe you managed to hide it from me all this time. Good blueprints. Must be for a zerk weapon. Papa was always so secretive with his work. He told me the weapon was working in theory, but he needed a real-life test. He went outside the slums, and he never came back. <laughs> I mean, what are you going to call this voice but dumb? <laughs> Observation's cute sounds are never friendly. <laughs> Goals. Old bacteria, human time, eat all kinds of materials, total vision in the dark, react to intense light. Zerks just sound like me, actually? Find his headlines are officially no longer under control, and now they eat metal. Well. Flexor blueprint, light based handgun. Um, what else are we looking for? There is a shiny can up there, which makes me want it. But I'm not sure I can get it. Aha! Chaos! Well, I was hoping. Is there anything else to knock off? Oh, hey! Let me jump up there, please. Thank you. Yoink! Well, I remember that. That's his tracker. Papa always used that tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we can reverse it to see where he went. 
Happy my papa might still be alive. I missed him so much. We need a weapon for the Zerks, right? Um, definitely took one with him. Just need to repair the tracker so we can find him. So my son should be able to help. Come with me, I'll open the door for you. Take care, Flex. It's always very good to see you. And I hope, uh, classes go well. Like almost looks tracker. Heroes are so many. You can find someone. Just find someone in the slums. Yeah. Fine. So, today's yesterday's tomorrow. Tomorrow will be yesterday today. Right. Damn is weird. You know, like age our soft one in sisters trapped here forever. Always happy to uh <laughs> to jump scare with my uh <laughs> with my voice acting. <laughs> You're too kind, thank you. You also get them. Come here. Yeah. You know, like, yeah. I mean, I hope they do. They're pretty human otherwise. With their, their emotions and their... Other stuff that humans have. Alright, I guess we should probably go to the, uh, the electronic shop to, to repair our small electronics, huh? There was a cat toy in there. Appreciate that. I appreciate that it gives you the capacity to actually uh, play billiards there. It also just gives you the capacity to fuck the whole thing up. As a cat game should. Is there something shiny? Or is that just a visual glitch? Oh. This is the bar again. Okay, so... Elliot programming is the one with the binary on it. Go figure. Okay. 
I mean, I myself don't usually yell at, uh, at closed doors for hours, but, you know, if I get into cat character well enough, who's to say? Hell yeah. <laughs> oh, well, that's a bird tracker. Here with this model, it's a Tohima BR2000. You can track anyone with this like a uh, may I? I know how to repair it, but when I'm trembling like this, I can't use my keyboard. I don't know if I'm sick or something, but I definitely don't feel right. I can't work when I'm shivering like this. I think I need a blanket to be able to fix your tracker. Okay, so... More fetch quests than I expected. Okay, so... For that, we need... Super Spirit Detergent. Whatever that is, I'm assuming another memory is... One more can. Very sweet of you, Goo, but I. Hmm. <laughs> anyway. You see, and here I figured that, uh, that, like, robots would like the cold because they tend to run hot more than they run cold. But I mean, I would assume if they are programmed to. Uh, feel co cold well enough that it, uh, that it impedes their actions. I think it, they can probably feel a cat. Does that that same can just get teleported back? <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> it, it just zoops back over. It doesn't even like instantly teleport smoothly. It literally you can see it move. Not again.
I was kind of hoping this would just take me directly to ground floor, but, uh... This is fine, too. Oh, well, we found our detergent. Do you have anything too sippy? Other than the detergent, obviously. He needs to teleport it to your head, cannoli? Oh, I guess the hint was supposed to be that you could see this Super Spirit to Cleaner box. The Cleaner? Super Spirit. Sip. Whatever. <laughs> you could see it through the window. And I did not notice. But also, now that I'm just one away from a. from getting the, the last soda can I need. <laughs> I'm invested in it. Where it be? And can only tell put it away. Catch me. <laughs> uh. She she is she is usually a jingly little lady. Thanks. And have fun. Grandma. Grandma. Thank you, my dear. I'll get to work right away. There you go, little one. It'll suit you well. Thank you, Grandma. Just not far enough. Wrong button. Okay, one more time. I want to go out. I want to come in. I want to go out. I want to come in. I really am a cat now. <laughs> Where did you find this? It's amazing. Let me try it on. Look, no tremors. I'm able to work again. Thanks. I can definitely fix your tracker. Let me take a look. Just kind of give it an update and one more thing. Uh, voila! There you go, little one. Good luck finding who you're looking for. Thank you! There is some part of me that wants to look up the location of the last... the last energy drink. 
because I'm not sure if this is going to be where we properly, um, where we properly leave this area. <laughs> that was only nine. It feels later than that. Maybe I'm just sleepy. I've been trying to get more asleep while I, uh... <sighs> wow! While I'm, uh... While I have this week off... To... Mixed success, we'll say. Box. Hi. How are you doing? But also, there has to be a reason to come up here, right? Other than just knocking shit off. Quite should I die? Thank you. Okay, juice box. I um I I have this week off of work, which is very, very nice. Um so spent it doing some some stuff to uh, uh to to fix some some stuff that broke on stream and catching up on some games that I was playing on in just personal time and uh, yeah, just, just chilling and talking to people and it's been, it's been good. Going on dates with Lily. It's an important one. Very true, Adia. Yes, Lily is very, very close now. Um, do you want to try sending those to me? Because I know that it can sometimes be frustrating trying to just explain where something is in a 3D game uh, through chat. <laughs> Dig it, huh? Regarding... Regarding Lily? Being here? Yeah. A little ways back, uh, Lily moved to... to be... to be closer to me. Uh, we aren't living, like, together yet, but, um, but yeah. It's very, very easy to go see her. And, uh, and it's... it's, uh, it's very, it's very, very nice. We went on a, on a, a science museum date on Monday, and we're gonna go shopping on Friday. Yeah. I love her so much. I'm so happy to have her near me. Turns out, being literally across the country from someone you love, it can be a... A little bit rough. Oh, hey, look, I think I found the, uh, 
<laughs> I think I found the last can I need. Thank you, Frank. <laughs> I mean, as far as I can tell, Adya, someone would be lucky to have you. Oh. Can we actually... <laughs> we could just make her mad. Um... <laughs> I'm so sorry, Frank. I appreciate your help. Yeah. Going through some heartbreak. Oh, I'm so sorry. Well, definitely take take the time you need, but. You, you certainly deserve a happy and healthy relationship. This is an early model of a, of a companion. Back then, they didn't have any personnel and you're just glorified autonomous cleaners. But I think it's nice that they eventually mimicked humans. Like they missed them, and in a way, they kind of kept them from going extinct. They're good robots. They're good robots, Bront. <laughs> we make robots. Um, where was where was Seamus? Makes everything worse on purpose. Did you manage to fix that tracker? Who did it? You fixed it. Well done. Give it here. Ah, oh, yes. The niche and little known gimmick of being a robot. Really got a thing. Papa really alive? I can't believe it. Let's follow the tracker. Maybe we'll find where my papa went. Let's go, bud. Or just to rub it in. Oh, and uh, congratulations on the um, on the gift sub, Leo. I saw that you got that earlier. <laughs> oh, hey there, Dars. I really love the thumbs. Angel's out there, but I must be sure. I need to know. Let's do this. Flesh tendrils. Those are a part of this game. Mm -hmm. 
Look at all those archives. They really lost a chance through this. Hang on, as fast as we were. Those orcs will get me for sure. Here, take this bat. Try popping the rock and I say, I'll know that you're a friend. Ooh! Oh, it's the dwarf for Hey, a, a family can be a juice box and a cat. It's perfectly reasonable. I'm glad you have happiness with, with uh, with your kitty. Oh, by the way, juice box. If you um, if you happen to want to, uh, to share your kitty with us, um, you can you can share a picture and a little bit about them either on Discord or um. Or in a response to the uh, tweet that I made about it. Well, that's not an imposing name. I appreciate that, that you can skid the cat. Oh dear. Well, time to run. Up. Bye, friends. Ah! No thanks. Flesh potatoes. They're usually so friendly. There we go. Cart? Cart? Are you okay? That was a huge fall. Dog should be nearby. We should. We must be close. No, not the limb. Good, the good buddy. Okay. Poor thing. I know that sometimes limping is less like a cat being actively hurt and more like a cat being stressed. Um, but it's still not a super great sign either way. And licking can be stress relief in that case. Also, just in general. Which, you know, doesn't need to be limited to cats. Ask your doctor if licking stress relief is right for you. A scientist I work, used to work for. <laughs> Always said he wanted to retire to a little cottage, fishing all day long. 
Of course, that was not a possibility in the city, and nobody could have done that for at least a hundred years. When we get to the outside, what if we find ourselves a little college with a harmless fishing rod and lots of book and a lot of books? I think that's what the scientists would have wanted. But first, we should go find Doc. Oh. 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 <laughs> Not the blob. Choose box cat sleeps most of the day. I mean, cats cats do be sleeping. <laughs> They're, um, what's the word for being most active at dawn and dusk? That's not crepuscular, is it? I feel like I'm misremembering what that word means. I mean, I know nocturnal means active at night and diurnal is active during the day, but like there is specifically a, a word for being active in um just dawn and dusk oh it is crepuscular hell yeah i know a word so if your major times of activity are just when everything is waking up and just when everything is going to sleep then it leaves you a lot of time to sleep yourself. Especially if you have a an active, fast little body that burns a lot of energy. But um But you're uh you're usually only catching small prey. Helps to not burn all that energy throughout the day. Helps to sleep a lot. Juice box is nocturnal. I mean, it does make it easier for you to uh, to to hang out with people on you know the other side of of an ocean from you. So you know, not all bad. Yeah, Frank's work do be crazy. It's an electric generator, but it seems to require some other part to function. Pop. I couldn't have said it better myself, Katie. Ugh, squishy time. No, I don't want to jump down into the squish. Is that... Nope, one way. Wait, can't Zerks eat metal? Wasn't that, like, one of the whole things that we talked about? Guess that might mean I probably shouldn't stay around here too long. Pause for my cat can triple. Oh. Uh. Can we break something? Oh, wait, you're not a Zerk. Who are you? That's my badge you're wearing. How'd you find it? Did my son send you? Oh, Seamus, you clever boy. I've been alone here for ages. I came here to test my deflexor, but it didn't go quite as planned. 
I wish I could go back home. I miss my son dearly. You can have a look around the house if you want, but I have no idea how to escape this place. I think might also affect some, so maybe they can't eat metal as long as they're under light. Maybe. Fluxer, will charge and explode Zerg's like confetti. Yeah, okay, this this was this was all a uh fucking um God, I'm forgetting I'm forgetting the actor's name. Back to the future. <laughs> I I don't remember his voice well enough. This baby needs 1.21 gigawatts to work, and the only thing around here of that kind of juice is the generator outside the house. Problem is that it won't start. I think a fuse blew. All the zerks around it's too dangerous for me to go out and fix it. Fast enough, but you might be. If you can reach the generator and replace the fuse, I should be able to get the deflector charged. Come on, follow me. I'll show you what to do. A top book. <laughs> I almost did it again. <laughs> almost. <laughs> uh, Echolalia to be a the cat again. Christopher Lloyd. There we go. Here, take this fuse. It's brand new. Turning on the generator will be allowed, so expect some nerds. Which fixed generator should be able to charge and kickstart the deflector. Just need to follow this cable, change the fuse, then meet me back here. Best of luck. Thanks, Doc. And yeah, character is Doc Brown. For some reason, I was thinking Doc Lewis, but I think that's the, uh... I think that's the character of Punch-Out! <laughs> Fuse. Are you following me or hey? Thank you. We're good. We got it. Amazing! You got the generator back on. You see how powerful the deflector is? It's definitely our way out of here. Wait a minute. I might be able to mount this deflector to your drone. <laughs> Thumbs up. It worked! The deflector is now installed on your fancy drone there. It's not meant to run off such a small power source. If you do too much, it could malfunction. Just remember, it's dangerous. 
Now let's go back to the village. I'm coming home, son. Hola! Hi there! How you doing? Take out all those sharks so we can get through. Working great, as I suspected it can overheat. Don't play vampire survivors while watching? <laughs> I'm glad we've gotten you hooked. It's cool for a bit, but that happens. I hope we're laughing until we leave, reach the village. Let's fucking go! Switch doesn't work. Looks like the electricity has been cut. So we to open that door. As always, we leave the important work to the cat. Are you just trying to button again, old man? We have zero please. Be, 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 be. No Zerblies needed here. Thank you. Become exploded. Something along the lines of, ooh, that was rough at home. But I was being attacked, but, um. Good. Mm -hmm. 
Are we back? We did it! Yeah! Triumph in return! Shaven Doc, little friend. It's great to see that Seamus is no longer alone. Now we know that we can fight back against the Zerks. Momo's been waiting for you by the sewers. Doc and Seamus look happy. I think we did a good thing together. <gasps> I get to try this again. Okay. Come on. We got this. No, line, line it up. Fuck! <laughs> Hi, Teddy. What's up, Rosie? Oh, Billy. You know my son, Seamus? Thanks for him that I came back to that damn place. Yeah, I'm so happy this is back. Good friends. Momo was near the sewers, which is... Somewhere. Grandma. Those are just open now. Um, I think we've gotten done everything we wanted to. <laughs> Why would you do this to me, Frank? My darkest hour. Jump on the bone when you are ready. Let's get out of here. I guess if that text speaks more, let's get out of here. We're in the void. How much darker do we need? I mean, it can always be dark, darker, yet darker. I can't believe you found Doc and got the deflector. With this, now we can go find the Baltazar. Let's go. This place is creepy. There's the robot who talks like this. <laughs> Gives the character off. <laughs> A voice and then, uh, and then mocks them for it.
I really I made up a guy. <laughs> Are you are you serenading? I don't see any way to open this gate. Can you look on the other side? Find the New York accent and the robot voice. <laughs> Would that even work? I would need to fucking practice that. Hop. Na 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 na. Pop two. Hmm. Unfortunately, I don't know how this works because I am a cat. Oh, hey, look, a switch. Hey, I'm commuting over here. Losing my religion is definitely one of the songs that is like never too far from from the front of my brain. <laughs> I've never been this far out of the slums. With you here, I'm not even scared. Good sign. That being said, um, it is getting a little late, and I am a little bit sleepy, so I am going to, um, I'm probably going to, uh, call it for now, but not before we, uh, before we show off some, some cats. But let me put on some different music. Do we do we have do we have any more any more kitty pictures? If um anybody happens happens to have any cat pictures uh speak now or forever hold your peace because i am only seeing one so far um oh we have an example for frank <laughs> sorry i missed that frank i i genuinely genuinely care about you a whole 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 lot i know i i sometimes like get after you for about like the the number of gift subs and um and and stuff like that but genuinely it's just because i want you to live as well as you can i want you to be 
confident in yourself and I know that you're such a great guy and you deserve you you deserve so much more slack than you give yourself you've been an incredible part of this community and an incredible part of my friend group and I am so 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 looking forward to seeing you again soon I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a real good hug Also, you have a good head. <laughs> um, so, that being said, I think we might just have, have one special kitty of the night because I'm not seeing anybody else sending theirs. So... Forgot that I started prank you all. <laughs> Frank, please no. But, um, let's see. We want to add one of them manages. So, our, our cat of, of the night is Ozzy, who is who is one of Frank's kitties or one of his family's, and he's he's just so baby. Oh, look at this tiny little man! Look at this tiny sleepy little man. the Ozzy. I want to heal him. <laughs> if, you, uh, if you have anything else that you want to tell us about Ozzy while you're here, Frank. He jumps on your shoulder if you're close enough to him like a parry with sharp claws. Oh, I love him. Oh, I love him. Thank you for sharing Ozzy with us. <laughs> One of the few cats will let you pick him up for extended periods. He's a snubble cat! Oh! I mean, he is baby. So, he deserves this. <laughs> Thank you for him. Um, uh, very good. Excellent. Excellent. Thank you. So, um... I guess with that, we should, um, we should, uh, try to find someone to raid, huh? So, I do see someone that I love very much playing West of Loathing, but I think she would probably be going to bed soon if I know anything about her. Um... Otherwise, um, what are our other options? Uh, Dwarf Fortress? Eh? What are people feeling? Dortport or West of Loathing. I guess we could also like make a make a poll out of it, but it is in a 
a whole thing. That's true. I do. I do care a lot about Fangy. So, even even if she's going to be taking off soon, because it's often her bedtime around here, I will take advantage of the of every chance I get to to send love her way. Fangy, if anybody does not know, is a cryptid who is one of my um, one of one of my my longest time VTuber friends. She's one of the people that sort of got me into this whole mess and. She's she's very very cute. She streams uh, like her her screen streaming schedule is is pretty intense, and she's in a she's 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 in a game club, which is like a book club for gate. I I really like Fangy. I I think you will too. So we're going to get this read over to her. <laughs> of course, you were the one who got her in that, Frank. Oh. Well, I do think Frank, a little bit ago, put our raid messages. So, actually, should we, should we, should we edit this just a little bit? Can we make this a, a, uh, a perfectly average raid? Yeah, yeah. Let's make that a perfectly average raid. Um, and there, there are templates there for, uh, emotes if you're subscribed and, uh, emojis if you aren't, but I really, really appreciate everyone coming by. I've missed you a whole, whole lot. I will need to keep you posted on Sunday, but I'm definitely looking forward to getting back into the string of, swing of things. Why is this, why is this music so concerning? Um, I'm very much, uh, looking forward to to getting back into streaming regularly and we're running out of time so for to everyone who has chosen to case long to the abyss know that the abyss case is back and we'll be seeing you again very soon bye <laughs> <sighs> take care